Actress Susan Sarandon has left a strong impression on the movie world with her amazing talent and ability to play different roles. She's become a lasting figure in Hollywood because of her great acting and her bravery in standing up for important causes. What's your favorite memory or story about this famous actor? Share it with us below. And don't forget to stay tuned for some interesting facts. In the realm of cinema, few figures have left such a lasting impression as the talented actress known for her remarkable performances. Her work has not only entertained audiences, but also challenged societal norms. Throughout her career, she's portrayed a diverse array of characters with depth and authenticity, earning acclaim from both critics and viewers alike. From a breakout role in a cult classic to an Oscar-winning performance, this actress has consistently delivered powerful and memorable work. Her ability to embody characters with grace and conviction has solidified her status as one of the most respected figures in the industry. Her influence continues to inspire future generations of actors and actresses. Truly, she is a trailblazer whose legacy will endure for years to come. Susan Sarandon portrayed Melissa Conton in Joe, a role chosen for her by director William Sachs because her nose bore a striking resemblance to Dennis Patrick's, who played her father in the film. Later in The Client, she took on the character of Reggie Love. It was director Joel Schumacher who proposed this role to her in a bustling New York City restaurant back in 1993. Despite initial hesitations, she was eventually convinced to accept the role a few days later. Since 2001, Sarandon has opted out of interviews with the NY Post, a decision spurred by a controversial story they published about an alleged orgy at her residence. This incident left a sour taste in her mouth, leading her to distance herself from the publication. These anecdotes reflect the diverse career and personal journey of Susan Sarandon, showcasing her range as an actress and her steadfast principles in navigating the media landscape. In 1990, right after having her son Jack, she didn't waste any time and got back to work filming White Palace. This shows how dedicated she is to her job. She's been in three movies that are considered really important by the Library of Congress, the Rocky Horror Picture Show, Atlantic City, and Thelma and Louise. These movies are like big signs showing how much she has influenced movies. In 1984, she did something bold by going against what Ronald Reagan thought about the Sandinista government. She went to Nicaragua for eight days and gave milk and baby food to moms who really needed it. This shows she cares about helping people, not just acting in movies. Both what she does on screen and off screen show how talented and principled she is, making her respected by a lot of people, not just in the movie world. In the Rocky Horror Picture Show, Susan Sarandon played the role of Janet Weiss. Originally, the movie was supposed to start in black and white and then switch to color when Dr. Frankenfurter made his entrance. However, due to budget constraints, this effect wasn't realized. Fans noticed a similar situation in another film Sarandon was in Lorenzo's Oil, where a color to black and white transition was planned, but didn't happen due to financial limitations. This transition technique is famously seen in The Wizard of Oz. In Little Women, Sarandon portrayed Mrs. March alongside fellow Oscar winners Christian Bale and several nominees. She also starred as sister Helen Pergian in Dead Man Walking alongside Margot Martindale, who also appeared in Lorenzo's Oil. In a memorable film featuring two strong female leads, one actress portrayed Louise alongside another actress. Both received nominations for their performances, but lost to another talented actress. The director of the movie was also nominated, but didn't win. The screenplay, however, took home an Oscar. Later, the director went on to helm a sequel, while another actor from the film appeared in a prequel. In another film, the same actress played a character named Jane, but interestingly, another famous singer-actress was initially offered the role before eventually choosing a different character. It's curious how actors sometimes find out about their roles unexpectedly. Tragically, the actress's mother passed away at a ripe old age, leaving behind a legacy of her own. In 2009, a well-known actor received the prestigious Stockholm Lifetime Achievement Award for their work in entertainment. During that same year, they also ventured into the hospitality industry by opening Spin New York, a unique bar centered around table tennis. This move garnered attention from fans and socialites alike. Reflecting on this actor's career reveals a fascinating detail from 1992. While filming a movie, they found themselves four months pregnant with their son. This not only shows their dedication to their work, but also their ability to juggle motherhood and their Hollywood career. These moments shed light on the actor's diverse interests and commitments, showing someone who manages their professional and personal life adeptly. From memorable roles on screen to ventures beyond acting, 
This actor continues to make a lasting impact on the world stage. In the world of film, there are actors who leave a lasting mark with their performances. One such individual, known for various roles, took a stand for her artistic boundaries when asked to do a fully nude scene in a movie. Despite previous nude scenes, she refused, standing firm in her decision. Alongside her partner, they share two sons. In a particular film, she portrayed a character named Jackie Harrison, alongside other notable actors, some of whom were nominated for Oscars. She won an award for her role as Sister Helen Pergean in another movie. Her versatility as an actress has earned her acclaim throughout her career. Her commitment and ability to bring depth to her characters have solidified her status as one of Hollywood's most esteemed performers. This acknowledgement of her talent is a clear indication of her dedication to her craft. Growing up in a big family, she's the oldest of nine siblings with four brothers and four sisters. You might remember her from a famous movie where she said a memorable line. She also won an important award for playing a nun in a movie based on a true story. In her acting career, she's done all sorts of roles from funny ones to serious ones. She's really good at playing different kinds of characters. Besides acting, she's also known for speaking up about important issues like women's rights and protecting the environment. Even though she's famous, she stays down to earth and hasn't forgotten where she comes from. Her work in movies and her efforts to make the world better are remembered by many people. In Stepmom, she portrayed Jackie Harrison. The film was directed by Chris Columbus, known for his work on Home Alone and its sequel. Both Macaulay Culkin and Jenna Malone, who appeared in those movies, later co-starred with her and saved alongside her daughter, Eva Amory Martino. In Lorenzo's Oil, she played Michaela Odone, earning praise from Nick Nolte, as well as a bravo from Jack Nicholson, who had previously worked with her in The Witches of Eastwick. In Pretty Baby, she took on the role of Hattie, and there's an interesting anecdote from Brooke Shields about a scene where Susan Sarandon slapped her, bringing authenticity to their performances. Shields reflected on the experience, pondering whether it was intentional or not. Overall, Sarandon's performances have left lasting impressions on her co-stars and audiences alike. Imagine a woman who faced tough challenges, but still achieved her dream of starting a family despite health issues. She surprised everyone by getting pregnant at 37, even though doctors thought it might be difficult due to a condition called endometriosis. This person, known for acting in movies and being open about her life, shared her unexpected journey in interviews, revealing some behind-the-scenes details of filmmaking. Her story shows strength and honesty in the midst of fame and difficulties. Throughout her career, she demonstrated remarkable determination, both on and off screen. By sharing her experiences, she has inspired many facing similar struggles, proving that perseverance and courage can overcome tough obstacles. Her story is a reminder of the power of resilience and staying true to oneself. It's not just about her talent, it's about her authenticity and strength. Her journey offers hope to those facing adversity, showing that with determination and a positive attitude, anything is possible. We celebrate her not just for her achievements, but for the courage she exhibits in navigating life's challenges. She is a true inspiration, showing that even in tough times, we can find strength and joy. Her story, like many others, is about triumphing over adversity and the human spirit's capacity for greatness. In a world filled with uncertainty, her example shines brightly, demonstrating what's possible when we dare to dream and never give up. Her journey continues to inspire, echoing through time as a testament to the power of perseverance and the beauty of the human spirit. Embarking on her acting journey, she initially appeared in Joe, debuting in the film industry as Melissa Compton. Interestingly, she had a previous stint in acting, starring in the unfinished The Next Oasis in 1968. Later on, she portrayed Reggie Love and the Client, alongside actors who had previously collaborated in the television series Her. This series also served as a breakthrough for another actor who went on to work with the same director in Batman and Robin. Moreover, one of her co-stars and the client had roles in Revenge of the Nerds and its sequel. Transitioning to the front page, she played Peggy Grant alongside a star-studded cast, including three individuals who have won Oscars. Additionally, two actors in the ensemble received nominations for Best Supporting Actor multiple times. Throughout her career, she has taken on diverse roles in various movies, contributing to their success and working with talented individuals in the industry. In the realm of Hollywood happenings, there's a story of camaraderie and support that unfolded during the filming of a well-known movie. In this tale, a seasoned actress found herself in a bit of a predicament when an unexpected visitor disrupted her sleep at a renowned hotel. 
Despite the unsettling incident, a fellow actor stepped in with a gesture of kindness, offering assistance to ease her through the rest of the shoot. Additionally, this actress had another memorable role where she shared the screen with a famous co-star in a heartwarming film. Interestingly, both she and her co-star had made appearances on a popular television show, albeit in different seasons. These anecdotes offer a glimpse into the personal connections and professional collaborations that enrich the world of entertainment. Back in the early 1980s, she had interesting relationships with both David Bowie and Sean Penn, which added to her fascinating personality. You might remember her unforgettable role as Janet Weiss in the Rocky Horror Picture Show, a character that showed she could play different types of roles. During filming, there was a funny moment when Barry Boswick accidentally hit her hand, making her react genuinely. But she cleverly got back at him by stepping on his foot during another scene, showing her quick wit and playful side. Besides acting, she shared her life with her beloved dog Penny, a cute mix of Pomeranian and Maltese. Penny even had a small part in the movie Bernard and Doris as Doris's loyal pet, which added more charm to her presence on screen. She's had quite the career, and her stories continue to entertain people, leaving a strong impression on the movie world.